and thank you for joining us today in our demonstration of the Tiger Optics Spark Trace Moisture Gas Analyzer. In this video, we'll demonstrate how simple Tiger Optics analyzers are to install and to operate, and just how quickly you'll start taking measurements once the unit is installed. In fact, this entire video is just over three minutes from start to finish. We'll start with the analyzer removed from its wooden shipping crate and ESD protective bag. To begin, we'll connect the power cord on the rear of the analyzer, then turn the power switch to the on position. The analyzer will perform a startup routine that typically takes about a minute or so to complete. So while the analyzer is starting up, we can connect the sample gas line. When you're ready to connect the analyzer to the gas source, make sure that you're using the thin head backing wrench as shown here, in addition to the standard three quarter inch wrench that you'll use to tighten the connection. A thin head backing wrench is provided with each analyzer and will help to prevent torquing of the internal tubing when connecting the sample line. With the sample gas flowing, remove the VCR cap from the inlet of the analyzer and quickly connect the sample line. Turn the VCR connection until it is finger tight. Use the thin head wrench and a standard 3 quarter inch wrench to tighten the VCR connection one eighth of a turn to seal the connection. Once the sample gas line is connected to the inlet of the analyzer, simply remove the VCR cap from the outlet using the same wrenches, and now your sample gas is flowing through the analyzer. Once the startup has completed, press the settings button to check the various menus and to configure the settings as may be needed. When you're ready to start taking measurements, first make sure that the proper background gas has been selected on the gas menu, which can be found by pressing the settings button. We will be measuring in nitrogen for this demonstration, so we'll make sure that N2 has been selected on the gas menu. Once the background gas has been verified, simply press the mode select button, then press the measure button on the next screen. The analyzer will first perform a scan to confirm the operating wavelength of the laser, which typically takes about a minute. Once the wavelength of the laser has been confirmed, you'll start to see measurement results appear on the screen shortly afterward. We can now see the first measurements from the Spark Analyzer. As we mentioned in the beginning of the video, it's taken just about three minutes to set up and install the Spark Analyzer and get our first readings. We hope this video was able to clearly demonstrate the simplicity in installing and operating Tiger Optics analyzers. Thank you again for joining us today. We hope that you have the opportunity to test a Tiger Optics trace gas analyzer for yourself.